It's time to raise my son. Oh my god! <laughs> The handprints are a macabre touch. Do you know who did that? Please tell me it's like a known thing teenagers here do or something. I really have no idea. Well, you really couldn't just say your friends do this for my own peace of mind. We're in this together, Jonas. What was that? You... you heard that, right? Why do you keep asking me if I know what's going on? I don't. I have no idea. Just like the handprints. Okay, okay, fine, all right. Jeez. We'll both be in the dark together. Yeah. Literally. Literally. Jinx! Crap. Well, there's something red here, so I feel like I should listen to the radio. Give me something to work with. Give me something to work with. High in the Cascade Mountains of Washington, the Navy opens the world's largest radio transmitter. Its one million watts can flash a message around the world in a tenth of a second. Hey kids, wanna play a game? Ah. They're talking about... it's talking about the Navy? Hangman? Be sharp and listen, mister. This is going to tell the classification board a lot about what can be expected of you in the future. How many questions will you be able to get in the allotted time? Uh, like a test? Hey, why are we being tested? What did we do? Here's a simple one to start, so don't hold your breath. What is the name of the school you are standing in? Ten we're standing in? Is uh, Fort Milner, right? I mean, that's not a... Our friends are finding this tough. Doesn't. Ah. You you think us cruel? Do you think us callous? I don't care. Just don't we hurt. Don't hurt playmates. Oh, Jesus. What is going on? Ugh, I feel like I'm stuck on a tilt-a-whirl. Just keep the pointer on the button. Question two. What did the communications officers at Fort Milner call codes? Who Ten. would know that? You call codes cookies? There. Now you're cooking. Coded radio transmitters have an important job, and you wouldn't want them to be unqualified. Earth, would I? What does this have to do? We are an island race, and through all our times, the sea has ruled our breaks. But be wary, young ones. Jonas, what the hell are you talking about? One last round, and you've cleared your exam. Pencils ready. How many officers died in the sinking of the USS Canaloa? Oh. Ten. The other ships, and other ships Nine. To sail them. Above all Eight. victories, beyond all loss. Seven. Eighty-five? Correct. <gasps> Ninety-seven brave men and women died on the USS Canaloa. Eighty-five officers, twelve passengers. It all adds up to another fact for the classification board. Just another fact among many. Here I am. I didn't need to get that far. Just right mom out there. This is kid. Female Spence, there's my name. Now I'm obsessed. I'm smart. Here I am. I didn't need to get that far. Just right mom out there. This is kid. Female Spence, there's my name. It's Sagus. 
United States submarine Kanaloa is shown for the first time in Pacific waters patrolling for the enemy. Pacific waters patrolling for the enemy. Through the periscope, the commander looks out over the ocean's surface. Kanaloa was lost today, lost at sea, near... Is this... Are you the dead officers? That sunk on the Kanaloa? We are the sunken. Yes. Okay. Great. What? What do you want? For the first time. For the first time. For the first time. Time. Just. Time. Okay. What? Okay. I. That was not fun. Just take it slow and easy. You've just had an experience. Yes, yes, very good. This has been United News, and thank you for listening. This is just unbelievable. Anyone, can anyone just... That's gotta be Clarissa. Let's get her and get out of here. Or use her radio and get out of here, but... Let's just get out of here. Well, at least now we know that the evil entities that be are the sunken soldiers. So not that far off from an Indian burial ground. <laughs> Clarissa's asleep right now. Be still so as not to wake her. Um... <sighs> Huh? I don't know if there's any way to save this girl. I feel like she's just gonna freak out.
cross your fingers. Clarissa, please don't do something stupid. Please, 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 please. <sighs> Clarissa. Oh, well, look at this. The super twins decided to grace me with their presence. I thought maybe I wasn't good enough for a house call, doctor. Um, are you all right? I mean, yeah. Why? Yeah, sure, my hair might be a little weird, but there's not a lot I can do about that. You just sounded really distressed, that's all. Well, I mean, I don't know. I'm fine now, so... All right, where's this famous radio? I don't know, I can't get it to do anything I want. Alex, wanna take a look at this? This is, this is like a low frequency thing. It, it's just meant for the base. It won't, I don't think it can beam out. <sighs> really? No, 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 isn't there a- Any officers who know your problems for and well will give you a friendly and sympathetic hearing. Who is that? Cross your fingers. Jonas, wait, we're in another, we got looped again. Crap. Well, just keep me in the loop. I didn't mean to say that. It's weird, it's red, but I'm not getting any feedback. Clarissa! Oh, Is there anything like no, 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 Can we no, no, cut no, her no, down no. with something? Clarissa, I would have swore she was in here. Better gone than dead. Oh. Maybe this was the, the thing, the radio she was using. If we can get it to, I mean, she got it to kind of work, so we should be home free. Yeah, it, it only broadcasts within, the, within a short space. It's not going to do what we need it to. Really? How do you know? Jonas, we're in a loop. We already just, it's okay. Knock yourself out. Get to the so others. I, did, I mean, it's I, not like I'm running towards the window. I can't even imagine anything. telling them, or, or how to tell them. I'm just... telling them. I just want to. We have to round them up before anything else, before anything like this. Like, I don't even. I don't even know Maybe what happened here, Jonas. Bird? If it's, if they're thinking of doing the same thing. We'll, we'll figure it out. This is unbelievable. because there, I really felt like there was no chance to save her there. Like, like her. Maybe she's supposed to die? It's hard for you to get that radio message too. So, one thing I did notice about this game is when you put the subtitles for the game Oxenfree on, if the message is meant to be heard over the radio, it will show up in the subtitles, but if it's not, if it's just like an old movie or something, it won't show on the subtitles. So I was kind of comforted by the fact that it didn't show on the subtitles because it made me feel like I wasn't listening.
Wow. Um, there's no way she got up from that, right? Like, there's no way. We both saw- Wait, she's... alive? How, how is... how is that possible? I'd bet all the money in my pocket that no one could survive that. So why isn't she here? This isn't possible, because unless she's built- We did just go through a... Uh, sort of a temporal anomaly, a, a time thing? Maybe it's screwed with what happened? Well, regardless, good news? Yeah, we'll see. <sighs> Let's just get back to Ren at the comm tower. Maybe he's had better luck than us at anything. Wow, new objective. Oh man, that's frustrating. I hope that wasn't really her, dude. I really do. I feel like we're just gonna go see Ren, he's gonna act normal, and then he's gonna be like, oh no, I'm possessed, and he's gonna like, go jump off a cliff. And there's gonna be no point in trying to save him. Like, I'm just so frustrated that I feel like I can't do anything. The quiz was kind of cool, honestly, because I felt like I was actually contributing to the game, but that was a first. <laughs> Alex, come on. Clarissa's probably not doing too great right now. That was like two thirds a joke. Come on. <sighs> what are the chances that they kill themselves and then run away? Or just run away? I'm so frustrated that these characters just run away. It's like, stay in the group. Hold hands. What's wrong with you? Hey! Hey! I... I saw you guys coming up from the tower. That's good. The Dick Tower. I think you mean Harden Tower. Please don't ruin that for me. It's all I have left. Anything uh, good to report? Besides that you're still alive, which I'm glad. You know, don't get me wrong. Thanks. Um, yes, I am still alive, but, uh, no. Other than that, no. Any luck contacting somebody? Nope. No luck to speak of. And honestly, I thought this week was gonna be a big karma dump. I found like 50 bucks in the street. Okay, Ren, how have you tried? And have you tried it more than once? Hey, we've tried. The stupid radio has been what my therapist would call a negative reinforcer. Just won't work right. Just, I'm so glad I took that second brownie. What? It's kind of, you know, it's just about to start doing its thing. When did you take a second one? What, How many do you even have? have? I ate it just before you came. And I have more than a couple. It's no big deal. Wait, you're not messing with us? You seriously took another one? It was like, it was like half of one, all right? It's just to level me out. You're it'll, an idiot. It'll bring me back up. That's what it does. You better pray to whatever God scares you the most. It does level you out. Because if this screws us up, you're on summary probation. Don't say that. That's not... That's not nice. Give me your back. Oh god. I would I would legitimately steal his backpack and ruin the back the brownies right now. We don't have time for your nonsense. I'm putting the whole group in danger, you idiot. And once again, not generous, not sharing his brownies. Not nice in any way. 
It's all about Ren, Ren, Ren. Ah, oh, Ren and Stimpy! What is Ren short for? Uh, that's not a good sign. I don't like that she's just standing comatose like that. This thing doesn't work. Whew. Not getting anything? I'm getting something, but it's like, I don't know. Hey, Nona. Night's still going, huh? We heard you on the uh, speaker system. You got that working? That's about all I got working. No apologies uh, for freaking out. Sorry, earlier. I was like, that's cool. Weird earlier. But hey, have you figured out what's going on yet? You have to know something. You've been like out there. Look, we tuned into something in the cave, and it was like Gabriel sounded the trumpet. Just everything went terrible. And uh, ghosts. Yes, that. Ghosts? Really? Yeah. And it would really help if you could just jump to the believing us part and <laughs> save a headache. Oh, oh, I got it. This is great. This is perfect. I know exactly what to do. Do you? Yeah, totally. It's Maggie Adler. Maggie Adler? Yeah, she has a boat. Had a boat. I mean, the boat's still here, but she's Her not. Her house, manor, or whatever it is, is behind a huge gate. You can see it coming up here from Main Street. No, I know, but the keys to it are here, somewhat readily available. My sister, Allie, worked at the park's office in town. She had to deliver that old woman her mail every day. I know that they have the key. Okay, so... No, no, gonna... no, we are not. We are not going to go with the plan. The first plan put forth by the group's resident, Burnout. Hey, come on. I'm not a Burnout. Okay. Well, I mean, Jonas kind of does have a point here. Like, do you know there's a boat? Or is this like when you knew the teachers kept liquor in the lounge? <laughs> <laughs> come on. I was like 13 when I thought they all got drunk at lunch. This is a real thing. There's a boat at her dock. Ren, understand it is completely your fault that we're in this to begin with. What? And now you Whoa. want us to trust you when things are really bad? Jonas, are you serious? This was your fault. Even a blind mm -hmm. guy could flail around and bump into that conclusion. You crawled into that hole. You got us stuck. Guys, come on. And you tuned into the triangle thing, Alex. So you can't pin the entire thing on and me. And I freely admit it. In front of whatever, in front of Nona and Ren, I blew it, okay? I should have known better. You didn't blow it, Alex. You only screwed up, apparently, by bringing Jonas along. And I freely blame your mom for that. It should be obvious to even the cheap seats that you're the only new weirdo who throws this whole social harmony thing we got going on out of whack. I mean, we all grew up with each other. Ren, it's okay. Relax. I like the plan. The plan's fine, Willow. It doesn't matter if the plan is fine. This whole thing has been a complete joke to this guy. Yeah. I, I can't believe you're even kind of defending him. Jonas. I mean, Jesus, Alex, when you told me Ren annoyed the crap out of you, <gasps> I had no idea how much you were lowballing it. How dare oh, you betray me? Like she would ever say Guys, that. Guys, stop it. Stop. The collective neuroses call a truce, okay? Yes, please. Look, I don't care what Caveman Jonas says. <laughs> there what is, is a that? boat at Maggie Adler's house, and the key to her house is back on Main Street. And the backup plan for when this thing fails spectacularly is two of us have to stay here by the semi-functioning walkie-talkie. No! Fine by me. Alex has the radio. Are you okay to go into town? Not that you... Not not that you wouldn't be okay. Yeah, it's not like... You know... I love that there was I'm no... Fine. Whatever, no, you idiot. Let's all she stick together option. You shouldn't go alone. We don't need, like, three of us up here. Yeah, I'll totally go. It's my... Like, brilliant idea or whatever. Are you kidding? Your food is going to start kicking in any second. Beyond yeah. that, you're a completely unreliable basket case. I am not a basket case. You, are. Uh... Just shut up, both of you. Sorry. Okay, keeping in mind who you've been able to depend on the whole night. Yes, keeping in mind who you're tired of. Keeping in mind who's taller. Who do you want coming with you? Nona? Wanna come with me? What? Really? I mean, I guess... Why this are you isn't, making me shack up with this guy? We'll be back later, so play nice in the meantime. Or kill They'll each be, other. I don't we'll, care. We'll be. You'll be fine. This is a total punt, Alex. Yeah, this no, is it's fine. This will be a good... If you don't want to take sides, don't take sides. But Bye. no, nobody's happy with this. Oh, you know what? Uh. Hey, Nona's happy. You're happy, right? Um, sure. Find the gate key.
Man, I really hate that this game forces people to split up. It's you know, really frustrating. You know, I do remember you from Mr. Tuttle's class. You sit in the, uh, back, behind Jake. I just forgot. I'm sorry. <coughs> oh, hey, it's, it's nothing to be sorry about. I don't talk all that much, so I don't know why you remember me. I'm also just, like, never there. It's a loophole where, I don't know if you know this, but if you ditch, you get a detention, and if you don't go to that, you get suspended. But suspensions are like paid vacation, you can just do your work over. Nice! So... Wait, if you don't really go to, like, class, what are you doing instead all day? Jenny, the TA, she lets me practice ballet in her studio. So that, really. Oh, and don't tell anyone, but my birthday's in three days, and I'm having a thing, and you're invited. I think Clarissa's out of town, so it shouldn't be a problem. Well, happy early birthday! In my family, we celebrate birthdays all week, so you're four days late. You gotta get in the mind state. Thanks. I'm sorry. I don't even know why I brought it up. That's not true. I was thinking about, uh, well, I'm worried about Clarissa and... Well, I was thinking about my last birthday when, you know... Actually, sorry. Never mind. This has nothing to do with anything. I'm just in a fog right now. No, come on. I want to hear this. It was last year, your birthday. Go. Just this was when Nicole was in her car accident, and so of course we cancel and go visit her. And I'm not going to pout about that. It's common decency. It's fine. But afterwards, after this totally emotionally draining night, Clarissa still came over and surprised me with this huge cake. And we stayed up and watched all my favorite movies, and she didn't have to do that. Wait, Clarissa did that? Clarissa. Our Clarissa. She's a good person. Alex, really. No, it's just, she just has a crush on you. It's like she's had a pebble in her boot for a while that she just can't seem to get rid of. Anyways, my birthday's in three days, and I just hope she's okay. That's all. We'll find her, Nona. I'm not leaving without her. Ugh. Yeah, yeah I know. Explained it all. Uh, Nona explained that Clarissa likes her, and that Nona isn't. Nona's a nice person. That's all she explained. Yeah, rocks. Rocks. Am I right? famously named after Colonel Caleb Edwards for his glorious and triumphant slaughtering of countless families during one of the great ethnic cleansings of the 20th century. The forceful removal of an ignorant people to make space for destined holders is a time-honored tradition in our still young country. And you will be a part of that heritage, Alex. Do not resist. It will be over soon. <laughs> The island is famously named after Colonel Caleb Edwards for his glorious and triumphant. I wonder if that was considered an anomaly. <gasps> yeah, it was! You can see down here. Five out of 12 anomalies. I gotta be looking for more rocks. I don't think I've been looking consciously for these little pile of rocks. It always creeps me out a little bit when they zoom in on the frame. I'm like, oh no, what's gonna happen? What now? These two blue-haired girls 
running through a haunted island. <laughs> you could do it, girls. You seem to be the mo two most level-headed people in this entire game. And I thought Jonas was cool. Nope. Free. Maybe that's why it's called oxen free, because they keep losing people, and I'm like, come out, come out, wherever you are. <laughs> ollie ollie oxen free is what you call when you play hide and seek when you're a kid, and when the seeker gives up because he can't find you, he has to yell ollie ollie oxen free, and then he loses. Discovery clips. All right, so we don't need to interact with this just yet. Cute. That's cute. I need to see the little heads in the bushes. So it's the Parks and Facilities Building. That's down a bit, right? If I'm remembering the right building, I don't think it's far. Yeah, I just hope Ren's not misremembering his sister's job or something. Main Street. Okay. Oh, I didn't even notice that little waterfall was there under the bridge. That's pretty. He did say several times, do you want to play a game? Clarissa! What are you... How did she get up there? What are you doing? Clarissa, where have you been? The last time we saw you jumped out a window. I, I mean, I thought... We thought you were dead. She's not right. Clarissa! What? Alex! Christ, what's wrong with her? 